In this video, we will learn on the meaning and nature of educational technology. First of all, let us discuss about the meaning of educational technology. Now, educational technology, the meaning and concept, it has been making a gradual shift with industrial development and technological advancement. So decades ago, the use of technology was limited only to the use of simple audiovisual in teaching learning. However, gradually the concept of educational technology it was broadened with the use of sophisticated instruments like mass media, educational materials, and the use of hardware and software in the field of education. Later on, the meaning and concept of educational technology was added with the concept of program instruction, system approach, micro-teaching, interaction analysis, computer-assisted instruction, etc. Now let us look into the definition of educational technology. Unwin 1969 said, educational technology is concerned with the application of modern skills and technique to requirements of education and training. This includes the facilitation of learning by manipulation of media and methods and the control of environment in so far as this reflects on learning. So, in simple meaning, educational technology is the application of modern skills, techniques, medias, and methods which will facilitate the teaching learning process. For example, the use of micro, macro, team teaching, computer assisted instruction, etc., in teaching learning. In an educational setting, every educational establishment has educational objectives. In order to achieve the desired outcome of this education objective, educational technology also contribute to its role, such as the use of scientific application of the software, hardware, and system approach so that it will facilitate the teaching learning process. Therefore, in simple term, educational technology is the systematic application of science and technology in the field of education. We have to remember that educational technology is not a haphazard application of science and technology, but it is systematic in a way that it is well-planned and step-by-step -step process so that it will facilitate the teaching learning outcome. Coming to the nature of educational technology, educational technology, firstly, it is a continuous, dynamic, progressive and effect-producing method. So, this concept of educational technology, it keeps on changing with the development of science and technology. So, it will keep on improvising. Therefore, it is a continuous, dynamic and progressive effect-producing methods. Secondly, educational technology is not limited to the use of audiovisual ads and it is not to be taken as a synonym to audiovisual ads in education because it also implies the use of mass media the use of sophisticated hardware and software in the field of educational technology the basis of educational technology is science as we have learned from the definition and meaning it is a scientific systematic application of sciences now, fourthly, educational technology, it also helps in providing efficiency to the task of teaching learning, which means that educational technology, it helps in achieving maximum outcome with minimum wasted effort in the task of teaching and learning. Another nature of educational technology is that it is a continuous feedback and evaluation of the results. Now, the educational technology also uses at materials, software, hardware, mass media, and communication techniques so that it will facilitate the teaching learning. Educational technology is also the application of scientific principles to education. It also lays stresses on the development of methods and techniques for effective teaching learning. Educational technology involves input, process, and output aspect of education. Now, educational technology, it accepts school as a system. In this system, the school infrastructure, resources, and teachers are the inputs, while various methods, techniques, strategies that the teacher used, the teaching and evaluation system with the help of audiovisual ads, all these function as the process. Whereas, outputs are the student's performance, the ability of the students, and the outcome of learning. 
So with this, we conclude the meaning and nature of educational technology.